guys, it's Nate, and welcome to another episode of How to Use Unity 3D for Beginners. In this episode, I will be showing you all how to use the Edit tab, or what's in the Edit tab. In the Edit tab, we have Undo, Redo, Cut, Copy, Paste, Duplicate, Delete, Frame Select, Find, fi Select All, and Preferences. Below this, I'm not going to go over until a later date. Okay, so we'll start with Undo and Redo. These are pretty straightforward. It, undo it undoes what you last did and redoes what you last did. So, those are pretty self-explanatory, I don't think I need to go into any more depth. Aside from that, there's cut, copy, and paste, which are also very self-explanatory. If you want to cut and paste something, you press cut and you paste it. And duplicate and delete. Now these are obviously duplicating and deleting. But, I'll show you guys how it actually works. So, to, to show you guys how this works, we need to create a game object. So go to game object, create other, and cube. Now move your cube into line with your camera just so you can see it in the bottom screen as well. Now, you don't need to go into the edit tab to duplicate or delete an object. Instead, you can just click on the object and then right click on the object and then press duplicate. And this will just copy paste it. And now you have two. Now you can also select both by clicking and dragging across them until you have bo both selected. Now, you can duplicate both of them, and now you have four squares. Aside from that, there's delete. So say you want one of these boxes gone. You just right-click, delete. You can also rename certain cubes. So say you want this to be cube 1. This is cube 1. Say you want this one to be cube 2. You can double-click and make it cube 2, as you would renaming any sort of file. And this one can be cube 3 for us. Okay, now we have find, or frame select. See what it does? It brings you to the box. So, here, I'll paint a picture for you guys. Say we have a thousand of these boxes, and I want to find box number three, or cube three. I'd simply have to click in the hierarchy on cube three, and then go to edit, and frame selected. Or, I can simply double click on cube three in the hierarchy. This works for any object, such as the camera, cube 2, cube 1, back to cube 3. Now that you know how to zoom in on specific objects, let's look at the Find tool. Now this Find tool, it just brings you to whatever tab you're selected on, the search bar. So everything has a search bar. The project has a search bar, the hierarchy has a search bar, and the scene has a search bar. So if you're looking for a certain object in any of these, you just type it in and it'll narrow it down and find what you need to find. Pretty standard. Aside from find, there's select all, which is basically just the equivalent of clicking and dragging. And then there are preferences. Now preferences allows you to change a bunch of things about Unity, but I suggest you leave most of these the same as we will be using Unity in its standard form. But say you don't like the colors of the background. So you don't like how there's kind of a dark gray and it's a light gray. You could make the background black and the grid yellow or red. But I'm not going to do that because I want to keep it standard for you guys. So that concludes this video and that concludes what's in the edit tab and what should be important to you for now. And until next time guys, see you later.